We'll be right back after a quick <laughs> Goddamn 77 commercial break. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to another episode of Full Craft on the Full Craft Modded. And today we have a special episode for you guys. It is a silly of maybe episode. I'm digging these at the moment. I definitely want to work over here more in the near future. But first, I need you guys to answer a question for me. The poll will be in the top right of the video. I need to know what you think I should make this. Now, I haven't got ideas right now in my head, but one is an art gallery, and that is the one I'm leaning towards right now. But I want you guys to give me options down in the comments as well as vote on the, what I've put in there. So I've put like art gallery, possibly, uh, chiseling bit shop. I think if I make a chiseling bit shop though, I think it would be a bit smaller than this. Like I want this to be an art gallery with tall ceilings. I need to change the ceilings actually, speaking of that. And um, yeah, I want there to be like a storage area up top on the top floor. So that's what I'm thinking. That's sort of my plan. And as you can see, I've sort of tried to plan out where things will go. It's going to be an art gallery slash I will probably also sell some art if the paintings go well. But that is a task for next episode. So definitely stick around for that. Uh, but if you've been digging full craft recently, be sure to leave a like or so. But anyway, uh, I'm now going to cut to a clip where we did a bit of a meeting over there, actually hanging out on top of those lights right there in the middle of the uh, town, where we discuss a lot of the goings on around here and possibly a new addition to the game which I think will change it for probably the worse but it will be pretty funny I'm looking forward to it and it has a lot to do with the shop so uh, enjoy that clip and catch me afterwards uh, when we go into a little bit more detail all right so we are gathered here today Oh, Ren should have read that, but Ren ain't here. Ren is, he's never in, in, group, in group events anyway. Ren and Izuma are missing. Izuma is excused and Ren is just, well, Ren dog. But, but uh, today we are introducing something that hopefully will blow everybody everybody's freaking minds away. Because today we are introducing an economy system on Foodcraft. This is going to be good. This yeah. is gonna be good. Oh, so I'm dead <clears throat> money. <laughs> what? Yeah. What we're gonna do? We we have a print. Uh, we have a print. A set amount of printed cash, uh, uh, on Foolcraft right now that I've been given by the server gods to share to you guys. Doc, you're very hungry for money, so <laughs> there's very, nothing new, Jeez. nothing like, new. Give me, give me, give so, me. Everybody come down and collect your wallet. Why What's is there that? cobble poop on the ground? <laughs> the inventory he's was trying, full. He's trying give to scam. Money. Looks like to scam. we need a street sweeper. <laughs> oh, we do for sure. Okay, stress, stress take that, take that. Take that. Uh, beat ups, there you go. Thank Falls. you. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, it's gone. Well, mine's got one All right. I've seen. I don't want this wallet, take it back. I'm oh, with it. We got some fat well, stacks stack in here. Who's money? Well, give me money. I have no money. Was it kidding. the wrong color? Well, it is a dirty, ugly color. No! Oh, <laughs> God, stole it. Okay. Oh, oh, no. oh, 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 it. He I, actually I doesn't have, have one. He actually Fresh doesn't have one. Hey, yo, no, that one's the one with nothing in it. Ooh, oh, my you. goodness. And there comes money out. Uh, there comes money oh. out. Well, she said she was missing a stack. She's getting bamboozled all over. Who's, who's there, missing a wallet right now? There you go. There you go. There's the missing stack of money. B dubs at ah. it the whole time. No, so, yeah. yeah. Okay. So Fantastic. Are we it's good? There you go. I, I got two, my, two more wallets. They are for Izuma and for Ram. So here's the thing, guys. We have printed up exactly 20 stacks of uh, freaking dollars to to, uh, to to each member, and that is 2,180 uh, bucks. Sounded American and everything. Wow. <laughs> $280 <laughs> each. Now, nice. <clears throat> that's never going to change. We're never going to inject money into the system, which, which makes for a very interesting uh, effect, hopefully. You, you kind of have to earn your money, either by being a, a stripper, <laughs> like someone suggested earlier, or, or or by having a sweet shop, which is much more I know reasonable. what my next shop's yeah. going to be. Oh, no. <laughs> oh my god. No. That was kind of weird yeah, that I saw he says, that. He says that he's by the pole. <laughs> <laughs> Slide down on that, please. Slide down. <laughs> Make it rain, Scott. Oh, my oh, God. Oh, no. is pouring out. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, I kind of want that skills. back. No, no, okay. <laughs> <laughs> no refunds. <clears throat> so, so uh, how, how are we going to avoid counterfeit? You know, I just picture somebody's got a sneaky basement, they got a machine, they got smoke coming out of it. How are we, how are we going to protect from that? These are uncraftable. Hold on, let me actually DOP Exuma. Um, <laughs> there, there we go. There, there we go. They, they is the old. Okay, so yeah, these are uncraftable. You cannot craft them. We should be good. We should be really. You good. know what is craftable? Go that on. Fake garbage is co is coin. Exactly. <laughs> yes. yes. Very good point. Finally, someone takes my side on diorite made money. <laughs> diorite mm -hmm. made money. My, my shop. Out. My shop will accept both currencies. I'm international. Oh. Oh, brother. Ah, okay, says so the guy with says so the only guy without a building. Fantastic. <laughs> Good. <laughs> there was no reason for me to make one without See you next being, year. Uh, whatever. That's your that's your Shefton music. <laughs> it's Chieftain. Oh. <clears throat> you know, Chieftain. I'm the guy that can provide food. food. You know, you don't, you don't, you don't mess with the guy that makes you food. Yeah. They might spit in it. Yeah, mm, that's gonna, true. <laughs> that, that is, that's right. Okay, that the fair, fair point. That's disgusting, <laughs> though. So what we have agreed on the server is, um, we're gonna, we're gonna try and make it so that certain things you are not allowed to craft if someone else is running a shop for it, just food. to kind of force that. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah. Guns. Okay. We got it. We got it. <laughs> we got it. You're going to sell German sausages. Good luck. Okay? Yeah. By our viewers, namely Dr. Rainfall. Thank you, Dr. Rainfall, for creating this service guide. <laughs> oh, city of baby. Uh, <clears throat> what's funny? It's his Dr. name. Dr. Rainfall is fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> it's his name. I like it so much. Dr. Rainfall. Screw, screw you, beat us. Uh, <laughs> anyway. <laughs> <laughs> if you select to do any of the shops suggested here, which you're encouraged to do, uh, I, for example, run a electric electric company, and, and I, I, yeah, and you, and <clears throat> if you if you run any of the shops or services that are on these boards, then you are able to charge for it, and no one else can craft the material you're creating. <laughs> to the ugly guy in the back, yeah, go on. Yes, right. <laughs> <laughs> it's just the antlers. So. And the I would like to open a post office. <laughs> would that mean color. that nobody can in-game chat anymore to help what? improve my business? What? Uh, it, Is this uh, I declare it so. <laughs> no one can in-game chat any longer and you will use my stamps. To communicate with others. Very fine. Next. Yeah, may maybe we shall wipe this off the yes. list. <laughs> oh Anybody God. got it any just... cotton balls? <laughs> <laughs> I actually have them. I have them right here. I oh, perfect. It, it right comes, here. Oh. comes right off. <laughs> no, man, I'm wiping my tears. Okay. Oh, very fine. Wait. <laughs> so, yeah. If we use VW's philosophy on this postal worker, if I take the hospital, you guys can't heal without me. Oh, oh. health regen off. Health regen off. What? Only oh, oh this, my god. Yeah. Sorry. You yeah. need have Sorry. Scar standing near you. Look what you've done, VW. Look what you've opened. You've opened a can of worms here. Every week, uh, with a break point on Fridays, Every member, uh, uh, one member per week, gets to be the governor of the server. The governor per, for the server gets to set a rule for that week. Something that he or she has to uh, force us onto everybody else. Something we have to do, something we have to restrain from, something we are, are not allowed to do, etc., etc., etc. And And of course, you know, it shouldn't impact the general overall building and stuff, but it should be something that you have to think about that week. As the, as the, as the first person, uh, I'm not gonna be the governor for the first week. B-dubs, you'll take the hat for the week number one, ah! and you choose uh, you choose who you will pass it on to for next week. An example rule, for example, could be that you're not allowed to with diorite this week. Fantastic. Sounds great. Is that going to be the rule? I did not choose such things. Hold Z. on. Mm -mm. This girl's persecuting me because he knows I'm, it's going to be something cat related. So he's not yes. going to pick me. Yes. No, I know I there's a conspiracy you. afoot here. That's fine. That's fine. I'm just going to be over here. It's fine. But but anyway, the point is that then maybe the viewer Bob who watches Scar's video will go over to B-Dub's comment section. It's your viewer. 
I don't know if Haven't you seen Bob. him? You don't remember Bob? Yeah, it's Bob yeah, MC. Oh, Bob. Bob oh, MC. Bob Bob MC. Everyone Bob. knows Bob. Yeah, Bob yeah. MC. One three three seven lead. Yeah, that guy. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> that, guy. Okay. Yeah. that guy. That guy. Yeah. Message oh, you every day. He sees the video. He goes over to Beat Up's <laughs> channel and says, "Hey, this guy's breaking the rules. Punish him." And if it's true, uh-huh. if Beat Up's can find evidence, Beat Up's is allowed to uh, cast a punishment towards it. So if you're lucky, you can get away with it. You know, mm-hmm. that's how so they're like the marshals it. of the city here. They're like, you know, the viewers. They're they're kind the of the viewers watch are the marshals. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. I, I like, like it. it. I like power. it. If evidence can be found, you've clearly broken the rules. For example, oh, right. whenever I get the governor, I'm going to ban any German food production for a week. Wow. And 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 if if if, wow. if it happens, still, you know, th- 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 there will be consequences. <laughs> Doc, I'm going to ban you French fries. <laughs> I'm going to ban you for a week. <laughs> Can I can I, can a rule also be ban Iskal for a week from the server? Yeah, 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 okay. absolutely. If if you All think right. that's fun, and yeah, it is yeah. for me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> no I, I see though. that. That's a that's a new level of hiding. You're gonna hit me next time. It's gonna ricochet. So be very careful, Star. <laughs> Keep your distance. <laughs> Don't worry. I I got a perfect aim. Oh, oh, geez, oh. oh. <laughs> no. That's I the meant fifth to do time that. You've killed me. <laughs> it's the fifth time. <laughs> you all saw that. That's so mean. <laughs> yeah. oh. That was terrible. I'm oh. Oh. So I know that that's um, oh, it so stings. Oh. That's, that's, <laughs> <laughs> that's my oh. screenshot. Where's, Just where's the other one? Oh, Skull. Oh, look. Now look this is ugly pink. Pink. He's jumping down there. He's trying to get out. Oh, he's trying to get out of water. That's my angel. Look <laughs> at like a fish yeah. out of water. Here you go. Here's some blocks. Have, there, have some blocks. Here you go. <laughs> hey, I can't place the block because I didn't do the roads right. Uh, oh. Oh, okay. oh, oh. There's some oh. up on the thing. Okay. Mm-hmm. Really? Okay, okay, um, okay, we're good, we're good, we're good. No, oh, no, no, don't hit me anymore. No, I'm good. Oh, good. Oh, okay. okay. Sniped. Okay. Exploded. Oh, okay, I'm, I'm miss, I'm miss hey, the there's a wallet up, up here. Yeah, yeah, that's my money. Somebody just dropped it randomly. Yeah, this yeah. Is... Oh, I can fly. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Are you trying to steal my wallet? I said no, it is. I'm <laughs> sorry, Scar. It, it wasn't my intention. Well, I don't know about you guys, but that was super fun to catch up with those guys. Also, though, what was most fun is this little thing here. Look at it. I've got a wallet and it's full of cash. Now, my plan is to keep this on me because, well, I feel like otherwise I will lose it or not have it on me when I want to buy something. But uh, since that is now a thing, I wanted to look around the shops and see what people are selling. Now, that bridge looks amazing. B-Dubs has done a pretty incredible job over here. Sorry about my render distance, though. It is very, very low today because I don't know why. I think it's these trees. The trees that you can't see. Uh, I'm just lagging my game out like crazy. I'm not actually sure why. But anyway, here is Scar's shop. I think we might need to name these shops or have, like, some sort of sign on the front. And... This is the first thing I saw when I came into Scar shop, and I don't know about you guys, but I want one of these. Can 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 you sell one of these, please, Scar? I would love a flower pot, please. Uh, a, f- a lovely flower to put in my house. Oh, and he's oh he's done that. Okay, Scar Oak Co. That that's a good name. Clever, clever. And in here, oh my goodness, has he gone crazy with the chisel on bits, man? Has he gone crazy at all? It is awesome. Now, what Scar's done is he's done a bit of a furniture shop. Now, if I do do a second shop, which I would like to do, I'm thinking either barber shop is something I want to do. Is that a piece of cash? You can literally... Oh, wait, no butts. Oh, butts. No, I clicked it. No, no, I don't want to steal it. I don't want to steal it. I right-clicked it thinking I, um, I'll put it in there. That's fine. How did, wait, do we have to shift-click it? Oh, butts, guys, I've, like, stolen money when I didn't want to. Oh, no, I don't know how to put it back. Is it the same way he's done this? No, they're just... I don't know. Okay, I'm running away. I'm leaving. (laughs) I didn't mean to... I wasn't trying to steal it, honest. But, yeah, uh, so I was thinking either a barber shop, uh, because I need something smaller, obviously, uh, than that. Although, I guess I could possibly build something a little similar. I don't really know. Uh, I'd like to put something with, like, a flat above, and then I can come to here to buy some furniture. That'd be really, really sweet. So, yeah, that's not quite appropriate for, for, like, a little flat or something above. So, yes, barbershop or, like, a general store where I could build things in chisel and bits, but, uh, 
yeah, nothing in particular. So it kind of leaves it open for me to build whatever I fancy. Now this is Azuma's shop called, well, as you guys would have seen, Hope You Die, which is a bit, bit harsh. And do look at these, look at these. I'm going to be honest, this just looks great. People have pointed these out, and these are tanks full of dye, and they look really good, really, really good. So this is what Azuma's place looks like. I really love the colour scheme in here. It's uh, it's very, very nice. It's kind of proved to me a little bit how, you know, perhaps to do the ceiling in my my place, because I don't really like the, the dark... Wait, are these... <gasps> Okay, I didn't know those existed in Decacraft. I'm pinching those myself. I will be building those and putting those in my, my place because I need some lights. And um, wait, are these Decacraft as well? Yeah, the ceiling fans. Okay, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. I do need some lighting in my place. There's also something over there which I'm pretty sure is... Uh, oh, goodness. He Look at him. Look at him go. Oh, are they paintings? Is he, is he sneaky or is he placing them down? I don't know. That... Oh, it's too funny. I'm pretty sure that's not a spoiler. I think it should be coming out in the same day as this video, but oh my goodness. What are these? <gasps> are these rats? Are they rats? Is this, is this another prank that I've missed? Oh, I feel like bad now. I feel like I'm going to spoil things, but oh my goodness, the rats are taking over. They look great though. They look really great. So let's head over here past, uh, past this lunatic. This, 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 uh, this, this, this teen <laughs> over there graffitiing on the walls. Um, oh my goodness, there's a hole in the floor. Yeah, this is Iskal's pub. So, of course, we're going to be coming in here to, uh, you know, just hang out in the evenings. You know, it's, it's dark outside. I can come around and have a, a some root beer. I think that's apparently what, it, the only thing he can sell. And then what we've obviously got, uh, Beat Up's Building Company, which, um, I'm gonna be honest, I haven't heard exactly what he's gonna be bu building for inside of here yet. But I am intrigued as well. There are definitely some chiseling bit things that I am willing to buy. And also, I think Doc is gonna be bu building somewhere like there. Um, some food store, which will be cool, because currently, all I'm eating is bread. So I am up for any food that someone wants to sell me. That's, that's it. But yes, like I say, we have 2,000 and something dollars. So you guys will have to let me know what it is you think I should buy first uh, and what other shops you'd like to see me make other than whatever this will be uh, after you guys have voted in the poll above. Um, I'm AFK in here and now it is cool on me. Sure. You can show me something. Why is he so scary looking? Does he look like he's got like a cage on his head? He's reversing, which freaks me out a little bit. He's gonna show me his graffiti, isn't he? Look, look at him. Look at him. He's all, he's all like being clever and. Ah, oh, he's put the word love. Are they just little bits or are they? Oh, they are just little bits. It's very cool. It is very cool. I think it's impressive. I like it. I think it's great. It took him hours. I like that he did it elsewhere and then came along and like spray painted it on. <laughs> that that impresses me more than anything. Oh, and they are 3D as well, which is interesting. They don't look 3D, which I think is nice. And also, are they just flat color blocks? Yeah, maybe that's why. There's no like texture within the color, but I like it a lot. It's good. You rebel, you. You rebel, this girl. Look at him. Look at him all proud of his work. <laughs> I won't put that in my art gallery though, this girl. It's not being displayed there. No one, no one wants to see that. We want proper art. <laughs> so since the Minecraft uh, accounts, I don't even know what, what they were specifically doing. Login account things. Me and were basically sorting out accounts on Minecraft, and basically it meant that a few hours um, this morning I wasn't able to log on, which is a pain because I had a lot more planned for this episode. But sadly, oh look at that, it looks. I need more detail in here, and I think that's nice and subtle. I want I want subtle stuff which is like just digging out um, from the yeah. I just want it dug out from the walls. I don't really want anything too crazy. What I might do though? Whoa! Why did hello? Uh, why? Oh wait, 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 wait. wait. Oh, of course. If I put additive, 
don't know okay that doesn't work right we'll scrap that we can do that ourselves if we want to but yeah all i've done here was dig out a little bit add a little bit of you know some lines vertically along there just to bring in a little bit of detail now i really really want to definitely before i end this episode figure out a new ceiling so I think what I'm going to do is, again, look around at everybody else's. Actually, let's see quickly what Scar has used for the ceiling in here. He's used something dark as well. No, in there he's gone with the same as the walls, but in here he's gone with the wood. Ha, huh, maybe wood. Okay, let's, let us let me go get some wood. Maybe some spruce will be kind of the night, the, the right colour, not too dark. Although I quite like how, no, because the floor's spruce. That, you know what, I think that's what put me off putting wood on the ceiling. So maybe... Let's have a look at that. Maybe some dark oak and some other dark colours, but we'll do that over at my base. Okay, time has come. We're trying out this for a ceiling. Yes, I've put lamps in, which actually, they might work nicely with this. Oh, okay, one moment, let me undo those. That looks better, doesn't it? Does that look better? I think even temporarily it looks better. We will maybe go with that, perhaps? Yeah, let's at least try it out over one side and then compare. Yeah, I definitely think that's going to look better, even if it's only temporary. We definitely just need some sort of ceiling in which we can work with. And I'm digging that so far. The lights definitely look out of place, though, so... Might have to do some research on what lighting to use, but if we can get a floor like that going, we can start adding it here, which is where we need it, along here, so we get a separate floor for some more artwork upstairs. Okay, I found the most satisfying way of swapping these. I've put, obviously, a row of the dark oak, which I'm using for the ceiling, and the spruce that I'm doing for the floor, and I've just gone row, 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 and then I've just got the replace on. Oh, and I need to do it like a certain way around, perhaps. I think I need to do spruce first, so as long as I keep clicking that way, I'm hoping when I go underneath, the bottom should be good. Uh, but if not, I've got some spare blocks on me, but, this is going fairly well, but obviously that keeps happening now and again. Yeah, oh, I, I think I've run out of, like, spruce. Okay, you know what? Yeah, maybe maybe, maybe that's what I've done. I need to get some more spruce. We'll plonk that down over here. We will just grab those. And then we should have plenty for all of this. Yeah, we'll have a ceiling in no time. Okay, last one done there. Now is the moment of truth. Firstly, does this look good? Yes, that looks great. Uh, we won't bother using the fire escape, we'll just jump down here, and moment of truth, ta-da! Is the ceiling done? Oh, that was a per that was a genius idea, changing to that. Oh, that is way better, why did I not think of that before? I think I wanted to not bring in any more brown, but I think I've gone down the brown colour scheme now, so I, I waved my arm around in the air like I'm... <laughs> Like you guys can see me. I keep doing that in videos. Do you guys do that too? But I think I'm used to doing that in live stream so much now that I'm just automatically do it everywhere else. But yeah, very, very happy with that. I think that looks okay. Uh, one thing I do want to try and do though is, is that spruce there? That is. So, someone mentioned that I should cover up the back of these. And I'm sort of thinking that that might be a good idea. So I think what I should do is, is not replace. We can get I was just about to say, we can get rid of them easily, but if we haven't got them in the first place, it'll be very, very difficult to do so. So let's grab some more spruce without out, hopefully freaking anything out. Uh, I need to grab the spruce uh, there. I think those are the correct ones, hopefully. And then if we do the connected material, there, 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 there. If we just do the underneath of everything, we'll see what that compares like to the other side. Can we go down to about there until I have to get under the floor? I have to go into the floorboards, but does that look better? Uh, I don't know, it doesn't really matter that much, does it? I think I can probably undo that all and be fine. I found I found that there's an undo, uh, the undo button actually works now on my keyboard. It wasn't working before, maybe because I set it to a weird thing, but uh, I didn't know this for a long while, is that in, in the controls, under the chisel and bits thing there, if you get down to the bottom, you've got the undo, which I've got on a apostrophe, Oh, it's the best thing ever. It's the best thing ever, otherwise you have to go back and forth doing that every single time. But, um, yeah, other ideas for this place, whatever it is. Uh, I need ideas, I need ideas for the cashier desk. Um, I need just general ideas. Uh, and also, uh, what other shops to make. Oh, also, other than that, we'll add the storage area, so ideas for the storage area would be good too. And... You can see I've sort of planned out something with dirt there. I didn't, I actually ran out of dirt here. But, 
I want to build like, like a little roof building. No one's done that yet, and I want to like it's one of my favorite things about the buildings in New York is that some of them have like roof terraces, uh, and and any city I think any any tall building. Uh, I kind of wanted to build a pigeon coop up here, um, or something like that. I'm not really sure if anything is in particularly very 1920s. But uh, I definitely want to build a sort of building up here, so I will have to obviously figure out a way, firstly, to actually get up here. We'll have to put like a little ladder in or something, or, or chimneys, or I don't know, what is there? Um, newer, newer ones would have like air conditioning units and things on top, right? So uh, 1920s makes it a little bit dif more difficult. It kind of limits you in certain ways, but it kind of gives you a lot more ideas in others. Anyway, that is sadly it for this episode. That's all I have time for. Leave a like if you did enjoy, subscribe if you haven't already, and next episode we will start working on the interior. So get voting, and I am so, so excited about getting started with the chiseler bit, little things and bits and bobs. It's going to be awesome. But I'll see you guys next time. See ya! When Stanley approached the end of the video, he clicked the subscribe button.